This is one of the strangest garbage dumps in the entire world. 100% recycled and it feels like street. It's far stronger than the original asphalt. Right in the middle of downtown Los Angeles, people are encouraged to get rid of their trash right into the road. In fact, the city is helping them do just that. They said, listen, let's put it in the worst lane in the city. This busy street and this garbage can are basically the same oh thing. So this is polyethylene, polyethylene, polyethylene. Okay, let's start with a very simple question. Where does your plastic go after you throw it in the blue recycle bin? Well, people with the best intentions tend to think it ends up here and eventually recycled into some kind of new product. But the pandemic has increased flexible packaging demand by about 5% or more. The oil that makes plastic plummeted in 2020 and since 2018. China is no longer taking our plastic trash. The unfortunate truth is that plastic, if it's not profitable, is not actually recyclable. Oftentimes it will end up in a place like this, in a landfill where it just kind of sits there forever. That is the situation at least right now. This is kind of the famous uh, intersection here, first and grand. Sean Weaver, the founder of a California company called Neo, may have a solution that starts right here on the road outside the famous Walt Disney Concert Hall. It is an uphill left-hand turn for these 118,000 pound city buses that just keep on coming. Most days, there are more than 600 of them. That lane used to be rutted six inches deep. Oh yeah, I know, I used to live here. You oh, you did? Right. Yeah, yeah. Do you remember driving <laughs> yes, yes, that yes, yes. The city of Los Angeles hired Sean's company to repave this heavily trafficked intersection with a new kind of blacktop that is bound together with liquefied plastic trash. This plastic road could last 30 to 45 years. That's three times longer than traditional asphalt. Plastic bottles and bags are now cooked right into the road down there. And this is a real solution for the global waste plastic epidemic. If this works in downtown Los Angeles, longer lasting pothole resistant plastic roads could pop up all over the place. If it works here, it will work in, in developing countries. Keeping plastic out of the local dump and keeping our bottles and bags from being dumped on the developing world.